Hello friend! Today is day 145 of Shaku Hachi practice. If you don't already know me, my name is Andy and I have decided to do 365 days of practicing my Shaku Hachi flute. If you've seen my other videos so far, you already know. I like to start off by pulling a card from the Enchanted Map Oracle deck. Love, love, love these cards. Super fun to read one every day with you. And yeah, we'll go ahead and get started. We'll pull some, pull the whole deck out. We'll give a shuffle. While I shuffle, you can think to yourself about something you might want some guidance or clarity on in your life. I am going to think about receiving the message that is best for my friend and I here to meditate on today. Gotta make sure we get some reverse ones in there. I used the first like few months that I used these cards, I kept them all upright. I didn't start actually using, letting any of them come in and reverse for many months after getting them. But I do mix them up now. Okay. Here we go. Hmm, strength in reverse. Oh, I hope that's not a lack of strength. Maybe it means we need to uh, get strength from others. Oh, I don't know. What could strength in reverse be? Number 44. I've got a little thing, a little alfalfa sprout. Okay, number 44, strength. Your true strength comes not from self-reliance alone, but from a sincere faith in a higher power. Mm -hmm. When you see the strength card reversed, pay particular attention to your health, for this indicates that your body, mind, and spirit need strengthening at this time. Oh. I think this is the first time I've read this message. Exercise, rest, and proper nutrition are necessary to keep you in balance. Do not deplete yourself through overwork, as now is the time for building your stamina. Perhaps you feel the bonds weakening in a relationship. If they are in danger of being broken, they may need repair. Attend to them before the burden gets too heavy. Be strong, face the reality of your relationship at this time, and give it your attention, for any fragile threads may give way. Let go of whatever robs you of your life force, and trust that something better will take its place. Oh my goodness, this is a very real message. <laughs> this isn't like all metaphorical and like thought-provoking, this is like, Get your shit together. <laughs> Eat some healthy food. Take care of your body. It's all about self-respect, right? Self-respect, self-care. Let go of what robs you of your life force. And trust that something better will take its place. Build some stamina, y'all. It's important. <laughs> Okay, while we let that message sink in and think about all of the healthy things that we want to bring into our life and think about things that maybe possibly one day we can let go of or let go of now or let go of later. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, here's some Shakuhachi. Cheers.
Okay, there's our sweet and simple practice for today. Thank you for being here and joining me. We will do it again tomorrow. Bye for now.